Right boys, uh, this is Raf from UKBombKeys.com from the forum. I thought I'd do a quick video on this Multilock 7 on 7 which is also called Garrison in the UK even though it is made in Israel. So I'll be using that pick, um, the dedicated pick. I really like this pick but it can be a pain in the ass sometimes because you have to know how to work with this. First of all, I'm, I'm using this attachment over here to keep the pick at its right place. And if, if, if you get real tight pins, it will move on about and then will we'll let you open the lock. And you really have to be concentrate, in full concentration to be able to work this thing. It's a beautiful pick. And just have a go with it but before I start I'll just explain when I'll say number when I say pin number one I'll be meaning this first pin one and there's one two three four five six seven on the lock itself this is number seven it's number one and in here number one and number seven so you actually you you put the pick in make sure that it's in the right position without putting any tension to see that it moves on real smoothly. You don't really have to do it in all seven gates. It's so cool. So the first method I'll be using is quite straightforward from number seven till number one and you have to practice quite a lot to be able to do that and which means that you'll set the certain pins you will have to pick them and others you're not allowed to touch so you get otherwise you will get a full setting so I'll just start really light tension over there you'll be able to hear clicks that's the first one number six is, is a pull through see I just pulled it up I didn't pick it if, if I would it would get me into a full setting number five I'm not going to touch it. Four nice click. Please okay. And here's another pull through. And now the lock has moved a bit. Now, actually, now there's only two pins that I'm missing before I'll open this lock, so I have to be very careful with it. When you've got the anti pick on the first position, it's, it's always very tricky you have to lift up the tension the pick put the pick nose on top of it and just let you go down a bit you see that's it picked now after you did after you've done most of the picks you have to go back and this is if, if you remember at first I didn't pick number five I'll have to do it again in order to open the lock and I've just did so now the lock is open. So it was quite straightforward. Now, after I've opened the lock, I can cut a key from this. If if I do have a a, a cutting machine, so I'm able to tell how far this goes. You see now, it does touch the pick, the pins. So this that would be number four. Six, one, four. It's the same as here. Four. This is uh, number two or three. I'm, I'm not sure. I think it's number two. Six, definitely six. When you've got six, it's not moving. It's slightly moving. It's five. There's, and here is the. It's it's a brand new lock. Here's the actual key for that. So you can see. I don't think I was wrong here. Four, six, one, four. No, I was wrong. It's number three, six, five. It's okay now. This is the first method I'm using. I'll, go, I'll do the other side with the second method, which is which is way simple. But you can use it now. This method, actually, when you put the pick in, let's see if we got it right. Yes. 
or just putting light tension and having them go like this while I'm doing that for definitely uh, two pins will drop and you, two or three you'll, you'll be able to hear two clicks that was number one that was number two and, and you've got a bit of a rotation over here so I'll, I'll do it again one two now, now, now obviously I am cheating now because I do know the decoding of this lock so I'm gonna go this first pin is blocking me so easily it is picked now let's see what the two was picked three nice click over there four 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 has led me to a four setting so I'll just do it again and I won't and I won't be doing number four now I'll do it later that's one click two click again number three I'll I won't do number four now. Go straight to number five. It's a nice drop. Now I think I can do number four. Now, at that position, the lock is almost open. All I have to do is do the last one over here very easily. Just lift the pick, put it on top of it. Now, to be really gentle with that let's drop it oh almost open I've got number three has came to life again yes it's open usually sometimes it happens but you can see it as the lock is open it's a very good tool and how if you have enjoyed this this is the key for that lock just to give you proof that it, it, it is working okay thank you very much for watching this Raf from UK bomb, bomb keys and Merry Christmas to you all bye